having worked in animation production for quite a bit of time in our career, that we all knew that before we started production, we had to lock the story. We really tried. We had really gotten to a point where we felt really good about our story reels. We all liked it, we all felt very good about it. We had a great schedule, uh, you know, Duncan and Megan came up with. We rented a space across the street from Pixar. We felt really good about our, the look of our film. And we really were feeling like we've got everything we need, let's get started. But we had always promised ourselves that we would show it to our friends that had a lot more experience in story. And so we had organized this sort of screening. There's really no way to soften. It was a disaster. It was a complete disaster because our story wasn't working. It was really kind of this very heady thing that didn't have the emotional arc that we were chasing. Looking at the reel with them, we actually felt it wasn't working either. That was devastating. And we had to quickly figure out what are we going to do? Um, how are we going to move into production with this broken story reel? And how are we going to fix the story and run production at the same time? By then, we already had uh, a team of artists kind of waiting for us. So any delaying story meant they'll be sitting idling, which we really, we really wanted to avoid. So we, we had almost no choice to move into production because we had this lock time. And we went into that with a broken story reel, um, started to isolate certain moments and say, well, these are things that we probably won't change. Let's get going on those things. And began to work on story as production was beginning. It was against the one thing that we set out to do, to change about how we made our film. And it was one thing we found was close to impossible at this point to actually do. There's no avoiding the, the tragic situations of something going wrong. I think if I look back now, I would get better at dealing with those situations rather than trying to say that we would have done this to avoid certain hard parts of the production. I think I would be more open-minded and more open to the change and acknowledge, oh my gosh, we need to change this, do it quickly, smartly. Let's get our supervising animator, producers, editor, all in the same room with us and hash this thing out. I think I would just try to be more nimble. Um, but but embrace, almost embrace the hard parts of the film with open arms. Mm -hmm.